Welcome to Wisdom for the Day. Thank you so much for being here. Today is February 4th, and we're continuing in the fourth chapter of Proverbs, verses 13 and 14 from the New Living Translation. Take hold of my instructions. Don't let them go. Guard them, for they are the key to life. Don't do as the wicked do, and don't follow the path of the evildoers. We must guard the good things that God has given to us. Sometimes evil things might seem attractive. We might remember our behavior before we knew God. We might see an evil action, and we might want to do the same. Stay awake. Pray. Do not allow evil things to tempt you. Jesus told this to his followers in Mark 14, 38. And Paul wrote, Stand firm in freedom, because Christ has freed us. Galatians 5, 1. And then in verse 14, Solomon emphasizes his words. We should not behave like evil people. We should not listen to their advice, because their advice is never wise. Proverbs reminds us that getting wisdom is not a one-time event in your life. You need to continue to learn more of God's instructions every day. There's a true adage for people who are learning a different language, namely, use it or lose it. The same is true of studying scriptures. Studying the Bible should be more than simply an intellectual exercise. You also need to consider how you can apply the verses to your life. For example, if people walked around with a sign reading, I'm an evil man, most people would have the sense not to get involved in his schemes. But on the other hand, does your department head at work encourage you to cut corners to turn in a greater profit? You need to realize that you're being encouraged to do something unethical and turn away from God's path. So let me ask you, are these devotions every day merely an intellectual practice for you? Proverbs are meant to be applied to your daily life. How can you practically use today's thoughts? Well, that's it. I'll be back tomorrow, but you can visit me at my website, wisdomfortheday.org. And while you're playing on the internet, why don't you check out the website to my other podcast at renewedmindsets.com. As you're looking around, you may see a merch store. Go ahead and click on it. You can see all the Renewed Mindsets merch. But more importantly for you is Wisdom for the Day merch. We've got some special shirts made just for you at RenewedMindsets.com. Until next time, I'm Rick. I love you. See ya. I'm Angie. And I'm Stevens. Welcome to the Christ Alone Podcast. Whether you're a seasoned Christian, a baby Christian, or just curious about defending Christianity, Christ Alone Podcast is your destination. Dive into the world of Bible study and apologetics with Christ Alone Podcast, where faith meets reason. Tune in and join the conversation. You can find us at ChristAlonePodcast.com. All of our handles on social media are Christ Alone Podcast, except for Twitter, which is Christ Alone Podcast.